Okay, well, now I'm going to put on things. Packard, I'm a dude. Uh, there were a bunch of things. I had this to have the chances of enemies attacking the character. I really, really like that. I think that's a good thing for a healer to have. Still. Soren. Your magic defense is still pitiful. I want you to keep that mana shield ring. Saito. You're a warrior just like Hallie. Don't need MP. Uh... The TP charging. I... This is super nice to have on warriors, especially for like the revenge skill that relies on TP. I just don't know if something's better for you. Uh, so I'm grants 10 attack, 10 magic attack. Those are just kind of straight normal things. I think. I think I am going to give him the Fury Ring. Because, like, I don't actually know if these work if they're outside the party. So if they're on Halle, I can be sure they're always working at the very least. Amadeus. I don't even know what, you've, like, what your skills are anymore. You've been changing. Let's see. Incites enemies to attack the user and restore some MP. Okay. Heals all allies for a small amount and grants them increased magic defense. I mean, the, the magic buff is nice, I guess. Holy Strike deals light damage and reduces magic defense. Okay, here's like a holy attack. Holy magic attack against all enemies. Ooh. Restores all allies from knockout. Oh my goodness. That's quite a save. Like, wow. But anyway, the point is, you do have magic attacks, and that was the question I wanted to answer, because that means... You can make use of some other things, perhaps. Uh... Hmm... Do I want him to have magic attack, though? I feel like the magic attack is better suited to... Uh, blank, because she's all about magic damage, really. So that should be as high as possible for her. Uh, Gwen. What actually are you capable of, Gwen? We saw some of your... Low damage attack that builds up a lot of TP. Okay. Increases the attack of all allies, increases the agility of all allies, increases the magic attack of all allies. So you're just straight support. You sing your songs, and everybody gets better at things. Hmm... Uh, do you use MP? You use TP. Hmm. So you don't need any of these MP items. Of all three of these are MP items. Uh. I mean, we're not busy singing. I guess you do gotta attack. But doesn't that mean you're better off using the other kind of dagger? We don't need this. Is there money? I sold that Rondel dagger already. No. Why? The Rondel dagger would be better for her. Uh, God damn it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Let's get the crap out of here. Bro. Gwen. There. You've got the power belt to offset your generally low attack, but now you can actually contribute offensively whenever you're not busy singing. Uh. And then there's Barrett, who doesn't use MP either. Oh gosh, how many characters use MP is a good question I should probably be asking. Uh, Packer does, uh, Amadeus does, and you do. So we've only got three MP items to give to people, and it's kind of a waste not to put them on people. So that's Well, the next best thing for you is 5% of your max MP per turn, because that just fuels your healing. Especially if you have to stick around in the fight. Alright, fine, we'll go with that. You! Uh, extra 10 max MP. Drains health 10% every turn, but restores 10% of MP. Hmm, that's... That's a bit... Crazy. I don't really intend on using you much in combat anyway, but like... His revive is pretty crazy. I kind of feel like with his revive costing so much, the extra 10 MP might be worthwhile, because that gives him just a little bit of leeway. I don't know if it actually matters with any of his skills, though. And then there's you. I would have liked you to keep your magic attack. Actually, this is pretty good for you, because it keeps your health load of uh, power up your other attack. I guess that kind of works out. Uh... Does anyone not have things? <laughs> I wish it was easy, or an easy way to check. You've got the Infra Goggles. We got the charge ring, mana shield ring, fury ring, ether ring. You don't have a thing yet. 
you can have... Oh, actually, this works really well with his ability that lets him uh, prepare a stronger attack. You've got the Soul Fragment, and you've got the Power Belt, which means the only item we're not using is this Power Crystal, which is Magic Attack. And the only people with Magic Attacks use MP, and they needed all the MP items. So, you know what? I guess that's fine. <sighs> Party planning. Uh, we need to leave... Though I guess we can, like, talk to people in town and see how they're feeling about things now. Let's do that. Let's talk to the NPCs. You didn't die. Sometimes I feel like I... You, you already said that. Alright, I'm glad that the attack had no effect on your outlook. Commoner or noble, I guess a customer is a customer. Can I get new flowers? Mine died. Carelessly. Also, I should probably buy some supplies. That's what I'm feeling like. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, we've already got a lot of these, but... I don't know. I feel like these are probably gonna be more important soon. They're not that expensive. I think I'll get, like, nine of those. Sure. I'll get up 15, 10, sure. Yeah, give me a clean 15 of those. I still feel like five stimulants is fine. Yeah. Save some money for the next town. Or whatever. Anything to say? I'll well, say this for you. You've got guts. Don't make us regret this decision. <laughs> Just get out of here before I change my mind. We'll do our best for you. Uh, what do you say? Good morning. You'll later be a free man or woman. Yeah, you just don't change your tune at all. Yeah, what do you say? <laughs> I guess you can still stay here. Is there any point in using an inn? Like, if you heal completely out of combat, like, why? Why would you? Thank you so much for finding my logget. Uh, she's still just grateful for completing her side quest. Uh, she stands to reason. I wouldn't expect a quest NPC to adapt like that. Yeah, you don't have anything to say. Uh, we never did get to talk to Amadeus, though. I wonder what he wanted to, or what he wanted to say to us. I never noticed his chest. Precision bow was found. Precision bow? Did I waste money on Barrett's bow? No, this is actually better. Or for riding through the glen. Bow with an increased chance to hit. I think one point of attack is worth an increased chance to hit. If I'm being totally honest. Eh. Inconvenience. Alright, uh, did I overlook any other chests? It doesn't appear so. Let's go back downstairs. Well, I went up here, though. Got that well. So what happens when I rest at the end? Does it even matter? Oh, it's also a way you can save, and it teleports you inconveniently to a bed. That's fine. It's just curious that they would keep a mechanic like that when you don't really need it. Take one last look at your house, Saito. Oh, I'm sure you'll be back eventually. You're still mad about the statue. You're going to say, uh... Nah, you're still on about your things. Wait, what was that? Oh, no, that's right. It was the same thing. I thought she said something different, but it was the same. I'm still not judging you, man. Oh, you'll sell us mead? Oh, 100 TP. Actually, that could be a really good thing to have. I'm going to buy five of those, too. Being able to top off and TP just like that? Could be handy. Thank you. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm a little disappointed that the NPCs of the town don't have more to say about this big reveal. But then again, maybe it was kept hush hush to like need to know basis. Uh huh. Well, I jumped off the ledge. These two people are no longer here. That doesn't really matter. End of the building. They're out here now. We haven't gone in the tunnel to make sure that none of the pen or non apprentices men slip in. All quiet so far, it's in the back of the fireplace. Watch out, it's dangerous down there. If you're looking to loot the place, I wouldn't bother. Everything of value has already been taken. If you want to go into the tunnels, their entrance is in the back of the fireplace. How do you know though? Let's just take a peek. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Ugh. 
I smell encounters. Let's make sure we're all set here. Well, actually, it doesn't matter because as soon as we get into a fight, we can just change the formation to whoever we want. I didn't realize I picked the longest path to go down by going left. Alright, so there's a hole there. Oh, hey, treasure. I just realized I can jump down to this treasure. Greater potion. Super. Meat. Oh my goodness, they're huge. Unstable slimes. Uh, they're all just unstable slimes, but I'm guessing color has something to do with this. Uh, Alright, well, let's... Let's make sure we've got the right people in our party first. So let's see. Packard, let's get you out of here for now. You have, like, attacks to hit everything now, right? Uh, what do I want to use? What do I want to use? So many options. I don't... Mm -hmm. Well, it seems like Gwen is probably a good pick regardless, because she can just power up whoever is going with us. I feel like Soren's just always good to have around. And you're pretty good too, Saito, honestly. But, you know, let's give Amadeus a chance to sign. Let's see what he's capable of. Now that he's, he doesn't have only a weak heal move. Uh, I'm gonna protect you. This builds up a lot of TP. Oh, and it's a tech too, I guess. Uh, you can distract somebody. You. So let's see. Holy magic attack against all enemies. I mean, that's a lot of MP, but let's see what it does. Yeah, see, look. Since I gave him that uh, 10 extra MP thing, now he can do a rebirth plus a holy strike. Not that it really helps that much, but... It just helps, is what I'm saying. That slime is distracted. She inspired herself and got all the TP in the world. Okay, so they are they're using different elements and inflicting different statuses with them. Surprised how they can still move with all those statuses. Sheesh. Holy fire. Yeah, that was kind of underwhelming damage for <laughs> uh, how much that cost, but it, I mean, it did hit four things. Mm. That's why you brace yourself. Uh, let's try this and see how that... Uh, well, it's all allies, so... Let's see what that does to his damage. You can backstab this thing now. And you're gonna go after her, so... Let's see how it is after her song. Maybe it'll be worth using that way. Ow. Goodness, they're tearing her to shreds. That one's dead. Well, the magic crit was certainly worthwhile. And there we got to see a little bit of... How curious. Sorry, that, that move interrupted my thought process. But we got to see a, a little bit of how a crit affects the damage. And it spikes it, like, tremendously. Uh, you've got a decent amount of TP right now, but not a whole lot. Actually, right now, I kind of just want you to guard, because you're in terrible shape. Uh... Oh, and you know, I guess the other benefit of using it in is you get the rest of the status. That's true. Alright, I'm gonna boost everyone's attack, too. Uh, it deals light damage and reduces magic defense. Well, it's not gonna matter much for long, since you're, like, out of MP. But I guess we can get you to pray up your power again. Yeah, that slime's distracted. Attack up. Nice, she countered it to death. And they're all picking on her because she drew aggro, so that's fine. Yeah, if she keeps guarding, I think we'll be okay. Uh, we're already faster than these things, so I'm not too worried about that. How's about you just attack? Oh, we don't have the TP to do the thing. Uh, you got a decent chunk of MP back for that. It's kind of nice that we heal after every combat, because that means we can go all in on every combat and it won't really matter. Well, that's gonna make <laughs> using his Holy Fire kind of work, work not so great. We might also be having like elemental issues here. It's like, unstable slime. Uh, what was I gonna say? I forgot already. Don't mind me. Oh, she can't do it. I was I was hoping she could attack twice. How about you multi-attack? 
I was gonna say, yeah. Like, some slimes might be resistant in certain forms to holy fire or whatever. That's the idea I was trying to get out. Holy fire might have elemental affinities. There we go, we beat them. Goodness. What a mess. So what's over the other way? Blah. Why does all this live in this cave? So we know this. this so we've got a troublemaker here and a spook. Hmm. I wonder if this thing's weak to holy. Let's find out. Uh, well, let's, let's see. What am, I, what am I doing? What are we doing in here? Uh, you go ahead and protect. You. Inspire yourself. Soren and distract. Sure, distract one. Well, actually, if distract does indeed make them target her, I don't think I want them. Uh, <laughs> or want her to distract the things with magic attacks, you know? Yeah, you should got all your MP back for now. Because all of those want to increase, increase magic defense. I mean. Well, yeah, because, like I said, once again, that bonus 10 MP. 10 MP is going to let him still do a holy fire after this. So that's a pretty good item for him. <laughs> Ouch. Now it's protecting, so now she'll be drawing egg. And we've got our magic defenses up. Thank you. So now you... Uh... I kind of do just want you to guard, because if you're drawing all their attacks... Let's get the magic attack going. You can backstab that guy, and you can holy fire the whole lot of them. Trollmaker casts Mirror? Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> that could be real bad. It's only going to reflect it on Amadeus, is the question. Ow. He didn't reflect that one. Okay. Uh, keep guarding. Actually, she's unhurt. So glad that the move works the way I think it does. Apparently, it doesn't work that way at all. Maybe you just attack. Attack something. Attack this guy. I don't like him reflecting magic. It's bad. Boost star attack. You. Can once again backstab the guy. And you need to, like, pray for him to be. Also, I didn't really notice if the spook was weak to holy. I was a little distracted at the moment. I'm trying to see if it was going to get reflected. Alright, good, that guy's gone. So many stasis. Alright. Uh, I don't know what agility actually does. Does it do anything worthwhile? I can distract again. Or I can just multi-attack. I just want things dying, okay? I just want everything to die. Oh, was that thing evading? It must have been. Well, it's gone now, so good riddance. Now they're both fiery. Eh, I'm like running out of time for this recording. I just want them all to die. Can they just die? Yeah, there goes that one. Sometimes straightforward tactics are all you need. Fire moat? Is that what it said? Smoke cloud. They're learning more things! Oh my goodness! The level ups in this game are so meaningful. What, what was that fire moat? What was that? Fire moat. Halves fire damage taken, but doubles water damage taken. Ah, so. Not necessarily the best thing for unstable slimes that could switch on a dime. But yeah, that's uh, I only needed six episodes for this session because the last one ran over a bit, so that's going to do it for now. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll catch you next time with more Chronicles of Fate of a Princess. Hope to see you then. Bye-bye.